Hi there. I hope you're having a great day. We're going to do a little sing-along around the piano and review a song about Missouri. It's our Missouri border song. It helps us remember all the states that are around Missouri. So if you know it, sing along. Try it with me. Here's Missouri and here's Illinois. Or you could look at a Google map image of our map of Missouri and point to the states as we sing it. Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, Arkansas, Oklahoma, Kansas, and Nebraska. I was at the top as you can see. These eight states surround Missouri. Let's see if you can sing it now and do the actions. Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, Arkansas, Oklahoma, Kansas, and Nebraska. I was at the top as you can see. These eight states surround Missouri. And let's put some rhythms with that a melody that we have about Missouri. We're gonna clap some rhythms, but let's talk about what instruments you could use. You could either clap, do body percussion, pat your legs, or rub your hands together. Um, and if you're like thinking, I don't have any instruments, I don't have a cowbell, well, you can find a wood spoon and ask your parents if you can borrow something for an instrument. And this works great. But I doubt if you have a cowbell at home. But a pot or pan works just as well. Listen to how nice it is. It works great. Or if you're thinking, I don't have a maraca, like this. Or a little shaker. Well, I had a student make me a great shaker maraca. And it also works great to do a whole note for four beats. Ta all you do is take an empty water bottle and put some uh, macaroni, raw macaroni in it, and make sure it's glued. Use hot glue or glue it top so somebody doesn't accidentally open it and spill it everywhere. But this is a great instrument. Or if you have a piece of wood, you could just use that to bang on. Or if you have some sandpaper, you could glue the sandpaper to some wood and those would not give you your sand blocks. You'd have your own sand blocks. So uh, let's do a quick review on our notes before we try to play with our song. And we have our whole note that gets four beats. Ta, and our whole rest is four beats of silence. Half note, two beats of music. Ta, half for us, it looks like a hat. Two beats of silence. Quarter note, we say ta, one beat. Quarter rest, one beat of silence. Our eighth note gets half a beat, and we say T, and there's our eighth rest. Or if we have our eighth notes in a pair, we would say T, T. So let's get ready to try our rhythm patterns. And you might wanna pause the video a minute so that you can go find something to use in, as an instrument, or you can just clap it if you like to just clap or do patting on your legs. So the music I'm using is also the melody. The Missouri song is also the melody of Bringing Home a Baby Bumblebee. So I found some great accompaniment, but there's a little bit of an ouch sound. Just ignore it if you hear it. So that's part of our other melody. So here we go, and I'll let you know when to get in. Get ready to play on your instrument or clap. Our half notes, two beats. Ta, 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 ta. T, 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 ta, 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 
whole note, four beats, here we go. Ta. Full rest, wait four beats. Get ready to do it. And here it is. Same rhythm. Now we have our eighth notes in singles. Dotted half note, three beats. Bye-bye for now.